to another video. I hope y'all are having a good day. I'm waiting on Slowpoke right here. I got up before him and everything. Got other people ready. And why is he still walking around getting ready after I'm already ready? But I hope y'all are having a good day today. Um, We are headed to the school because Connor has awards day today. Yay, Connor. Um, Yeah, yeah it's been a while since I vlogged. But I'm happy that you decided to come here. If you haven't done so, please hit the subscribe button and hit the thumbs up if you enjoy this content. But come along with us. And I'm not sure how much I'm going to get because it's an awards day. And I don't know that he's going to get an award. He probably will, but I don't know what award he's going to get. So I would definitely show y'all what award he gets if he gets an award. But but I'm just excited for the year to be over. And I know a lot of you parents are. You don't have to wake up at... 5.45 in the morning to get the kids together. Thank you, Jesus. I'll see y'all when we get there. So it's the next day. Uh, My mom messed up. She forgot to record it. But, okay, I'll come here. No time, all right? Look at that boy out now. Hey, what are we going to do today, man? That a big. Huh? Big day, right? What about you, big can? Huh? Turn around. What you going to do? You ain't funny today, ain't you? Boy, got him now. Let me find a clean can I got on, right? Can. You got to switch it up, bro. Can't wear Jordan all the time. No, 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 no. All right, y'all go. I ain't gonna let Cam be the last one. Yeah. 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 Here we go, y'all. Good man, all that over here. Hey y'all, so it's the next day. I don't know if you saw that on the earlier clip with Connor or not. Now we are headed to, um, I can't even think straight. Carter and Cam's graduation. And um, yesterday I forgot to, well, I thought I was recording because I'm using my phone. Look at him in the mirror, y'all. Y'all see him? I thought I was using my phone. Well, I was using my phone and I'm not used to using my phone to record. And by the time I got it up, he had already got his little award. So he got the Bulldog Award, the Citizenship Award, Most Improved award and a PE award so and I forgot well I didn't forget recorded but I just messed up but uh, we're on the way and I hope Carter and Connor Carter and Cam will do a good job today because Cam was mad this morning because he had to wear some um vans and I'm like boy shut up because we spend money on y'all all the time and the shoes that you like to wear they look a mess so no that's not even an option today but hopefully he'll be over it by the time we get there, so I'll see y'all very soon. Thank you, I'm going to go. This is a trip. Bulldog Award, 4-H. Music, she has a PD Award, Captain. Okay, y'all, so right here in this clip, I'm showing where they let the fifth graders do their final walkthrough through the school hallways, and they gather in the front of the school to take one last photo together. <laughs> <laughs> and right here Carter received an award it's called the Yellow Brick Road Award and it shows leadership um, athleticism this is his coach in this video with him um, y'all excuse the toothpaste on his shirt. I did not see that until I got to, to his school. I was so mad, but it shows leadership. Um, it shows a responsible student. It shows basically the model student. And, um, they said that Carter was one of those students. So they allowed them to, um, paint their, um, handprints and they put it up on the wall in the gym and then they wrote their names under it. And then it'll always be there for, um, memory sake. So I thought that was pretty cool. So his paw will always be in the gym. I 
against me. Spread your fingers out. You go right there, okay? Right there. Don't move, okay? Freeze. Count three and you come straight off, okay? One, two. Nicely done. All right, now, keep the hand up. I do that now because several years ago I spelled one wrong. Now we're about to bring you out to Cam's graduation. Kindergarten graduation, citizenship, bulldog award, academic achievement. Thank you. Get out that cheese on his mouth. Kev, you making a mess. I don't know what you need to do. Go on and put it in your mouth. You made me pay my mother when you were in, you still want to see my mother. What you trying to tell him? He got a girlfriend? No, I said he's on the phone with, with his friends. Yeah, he's trying to find out if he can get back with his girlfriend. Yeah, he's trying to find out if he can get back with his girlfriend. Yeah, he's trying to find out if he can get back with his girlfriend. So yeah, we are officially done with graduation stuff in the school year. Thank God, it's like, what you say? It's like, what time is it? It's one, 12.54, and we just now eating for. Hold on, we just now eating for today, and um, as y'all know, Carter's, well, I don't know if y'all knew this, but his graduation started at like 8.30 a.m. today. And then Cam's graduation was at 10.30 in the same place. So after Carter's graduation, they they um did what, thank you, they did what they did. And then they let all the fifth graders walk the hall for the last time, which I thought was cool. And then Carter got... He got his graduation award and I forgot what all was on there because now they like give you a certificate when you graduate and they put like different awards on there. And then for the fifth graders, they came back and they gave them like other little stuff. So Carter got a, what was that ribbon you got Carter? That ribbon, what, what, you at? what was that ribbon for that you got? That's what Oh, I, thought, I thought it was a different award. I know that is. You got that gave you a ribbon on your wrist. What was that for? Oh. Well, he got the award too, but I know y'all saw a clip, but I'm gonna explain it to you. It's um it's called a yellow brick award. And they have like seven fifth grade classes in that school. And what they did, they chose. So they said they used to do only a boy and a girl from the whole fifth grade level. But they said it was just too many to choose from. So out of that, I think they ended up with like six or seven out of the whole fifth grade, which is like seven different classes. But they nominated students and they let the students nominate. So they nominated students who are, who has a good attitude who shows um, good leadership and just helpful and they say all around is kind students. And so he was one of those. And what he got to do, I think it was pretty cool how they did it. They, um, he got his paw because they have the bulldog. So they get their um, handprint and they put it on the wall in the gym and they, um, boy, they make it a mess. And it stayed there forever until, you know, as long as the gym is there. But um, he was one of the ones who got his hand put on the wall. So I thought that was a good thing. And then with Cam, he got another award after he got back to class. His teacher gave him one for being helpful. She was like, even when I don't need the help, he's always trying to help me. And I'm like, I know exactly what you mean. But um, yeah, they did a song, the kindergartners, 
the kindergarten piece on my cam got to talk a lot of more. The kindergartners did a song at the end, and I was just mad because they was. Well, I wasn't mad. I was just irritated because I had been there all day already, and I was ready to go. But they did a song, and then they were like, "We about to do a song, and tell me why everybody in the gym they just started walking up." And I'm like, um, "Ain't we all here to see our kids?" So. I didn't even have room to record it. I, and I was about to fight to record it. So I just sat there and I was just a little bit agitated. But now we're here at the Mexican restaurant. Everybody's hungry. So. Who are you supposed to be? You have to dip it or you want me to hold on in? Dip it. Hold on in. Don't dip it. So the boys are sharing hot wings. They're sharing hot wings. We got the one beef, one cheese. One beef, one cheese, enchilada with rice and beans. Okay, you eat celery. Okay. And I got the one beef, one cheese, enchilada without the red sauce or the beans because I don't like beans. Why do you look like this? You know what I mean? They're not okay, but they're trying to get better than okay. All right. So, y'all, please forgive me. I forgot to come back yesterday. Um, It's the next day. I just said I forgot to come back yesterday. But it's the next day. And um, we didn't do much yesterday. After we left, we went to go. Where did we went to go? We went to Lowe's to try to um, find some patio furniture. Because every time we go somewhere to find patio furniture, we find the one we like. And the one that we like, for some reason, is going to be some part of it that they don't have. So, we thought we had one yesterday because we have been on this rodeo more than one time. We tried Big Lots. We tried um, Lowe's. We tried... I can't think of what else we tried, but I'm, at this point, I'm just going to go online and I'll probably order some and have it um, delivered here. But we had what we thought we wanted, and then they came back and told us that they didn't have the table to go with it. We didn't do much yesterday other than that. I came home and um, after we tried the patio furniture and um, they didn't have the table to go with it. So I went online and I think I found the one that I want. But... Um, yeah, I'm here with Case and Cam, and I'm, I'm about to clean up because we have a lot to do today. And as you can see, my energy, I feel kind of renewed today. So I'm about to clean up, and I think I'll get a Saturday. Yes, Case. I think I'll get a Saturday vlog started when I get done and, and start doing whatever I need to do. But yeah, I got this kitchen to tackle. Oh, yeah. It ain't too bad, but oh, yeah. it's enough for me. So I'm about to do um, the whole house and vacuum and all that good stuff. To everybody who has somebody graduating, congratulations, whether it's kindergarten, fifth grade, pre-K, um, high school, college, whatever, because I had a moment the other day. It was before they graduated and I got emotional just thinking about um, just the recent events that happened and i try not to think about it because i'm the type of person if you tell me a problem it becomes my problem and i'm trying to fix it i'm trying to empathize and i'm like getting in your head like trying to feel how you feel and i don't know why i take it to that extent but that's just the type of person i am so when this happened with the schools y'all i don't know what i'm talking about uh, when stuff like that happened i'm not numb to it it's just i try to not think about it because it hits so close to home because I have kids as many of you do and I work in a school and although I'm a parent as a teacher it's still my job to protect all those kids who are in my class or who are around me it really hit close to home for me so it hit different so I'll try not to think about it but at the same time it's like 
I feel grateful, but I feel like what, you know, like what did those people do to deserve that? And, you know, I'm lucky enough to not have gone through that. And hopefully I never have to experience that. And I couldn't even begin to imagine. It's like I'm celebrating while somebody else is sitting there planning for the final arrangements for the child. So it's, it kind of had me emotional, but I try to keep busy and try not to think about it. But whenever you go on social media, that's all you, that's all you're going to see right now. So I'm trying to stay away from that. So I want to keep my spirits up and I, my hearts do go out to anybody who was involved in that incident or if you were affected by it in any way. So y'all just love on your babies. But on a, a, a brighter note, y'all go ahead and hit the subscribe button if you haven't done so already. If you like this content and you want to see more, hit subscribe. Go ahead and subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up so YouTube can start recommending our videos to other people and you may, it may recommend some of our older videos to you also if you're new here. And um, yeah, leave us a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video, y'all. Thank y'all so much for your love and support. I really do appreciate it. Y'all have a good day and y'all be safe. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye.